Happy Star Wars Day, guys. And what better matchup can there be than Warhammer 40k and Star Wars? Which is why I made my intercessor kill team out of stormtroopers. I did that by converting my Primaris intercessors, which I got from Jadlam Games. There's a link in the description, guys. Go check them out. As they were kind enough to send me this box some time ago. And as you can see, they do a whole array of sort of Warhammer stuff, all competitively priced. So I actually converted these guys, well, some time ago. I'll leave a link to the video at the very end of this video. Um, as yeah, obviously with Kill Team, I love trying out, well, the different Kill Teams. So yeah, this is one of them. Uh, if you're new to Warhammer 40k Kill Teams, the Intercessor Squad are probably a good one to go for, as they're relatively simple, um, they're not very difficult to play, and they are quite beefy. So yeah, you should enjoy it uh, somewhat. So yeah, good old slap chop painting and all the rest, but so I won't go into the, uh, the full sort of kit bash in here, as there is a video that shows, well, everything you need to know. One thing I will go on to say though, is this kill team and the display box you can now see are currently on my eBay site. And these are being sold as one listing, so it is a case of getting the kill team and the box, which is pretty cool. And as I say, this is a fun team to play and certainly one that's very good for beginners, which is kind of why, well, I started off using them. I'm also going to include the data cards that I use. Uh, these are obviously just handy little reminders, showing obviously what each character can do. Obviously how many wounds it can it can take, uh, in movement, save and throws, and obviously the all-important sort of damage it can deal. So yeah, they'll be included in this little uh, little bundle as well. And just in case you wanted to see how I took the uh, well the initial footage that you guys would have seen right at the very beginning, so this is my sort of simple little setup. I use a, a webcam and obviously one light sort of fairly near whatever it is I'm taking pictures of or video of, and obviously the all-important smoke. I love using this. So this is from Costronica. There's a link in the description, guys, to where you can get these from. They do a, a variety. This is one of the smaller ones. Um, but as you can see, it still pumps out a lovely lot of smoke, which is great for, uh, well, for the atmospheric sort of shots that I take. So, yeah, link in the description. Go check them out as, yeah, I think it's an awesome piece of equipment, which, um, yeah, I do love using. <laughs> uh, can't help putting a bit of smoke for, uh, for good old atmosphere. So this was a just short little video, guys, to say happy Star Wars Day. As I say, combining two of my favourite things. Um, yeah, Star Wars and Warhammer. Um, yeah, I saw Star Wars, well, back in 77, because I am pretty old. Um, but yeah, I love playing this team, and so I don't really play it now, which is why I'm happy to sell this one. As I do play the Legionnaires quite a lot, and I've been, well, been getting on pretty well with them. So if you want to see me doing the conversion of these guys, the video is on the screen now. Don't forget to click any of the links down below, especially the eBay one, because that does help me out a lot. So I'll say a big shout out and thank you to all my lovely patrons, as well as Chaos Cards, for helping support the channel. There's a link down below, guys, so you can get 5% off the, uh, the Chaos Cards miniatures. And don't forget to like, share, subscribe, all that good stuff. Okay, guys, see you in the next one. Bye for now.